Hello everyone, I'm Sue Levitt. Thanks for joining us for this City News Update. Well, the city has a few ways you can celebrate Dia de los Muertos. Dia de los Muertos, or Day of the Dead, is a holiday tradition originating from Mexico and a day set aside to honor those who have passed away. Tuesday, November 2nd, from 4 to 9 p.m., the city is hosting a celebration at the Sammy Davis Jr. Festival Plaza in Lorenzi Park, located at 720 Twin Lakes Drive. The event is free and open to the public. The cultural tribute will include special entertainment, food trucks, and exhibition of altars created by community community organizations, and much more. You can also check out the Versions of a Family Ofrenda exhibit through November 25th. The exhibit is located at the Charleston Heights Art Center Gallery at 800 South Brush Street. You'll see how a group of local Hispanic artists have created their own interpretations of an ofrenda or home altar, usually created for an individual or family member that has passed on as a way to welcome their spirit back into our world for one day every year. Through various mediums and techniques, these artists have embodied what ofrenda means to them and their family traditions. The exhibit is free and open to the public. For more information, you can visit artslasvegas.org or call 702-229-ARTS. Well, the Nevada Department of Transportation has a new tool for commuters who use Interstate 515 in Las Vegas. The tool, integrated with NDOT's website, is a source for Nevadans to view all ongoing and future projects planned along I-515. Commuters can visit dot.nv.gov slash nv515 to view a detailed map of projects, get in touch with NDOT project managers, and more readily access project information and timelines. And the Regional Transportation Commission has launched an app to allow paratransit riders and caretakers to book, cancel, and manage rides with the touch of a button. Through the MyRTC Para website and app, customers can book new trips, check and cancel existing reservations, track vehicles, access estimated pickup times, and additional services. For more information, you can visit myrtcpara.rtcsn.com or you can download the MyRTC Para app by visiting the Apple App Store or Google Play. Well, that's all for this news update. Thanks for joining us. Have a great day, and we'll see you tomorrow.